Executive Director of the Bahamas Hotel Association, Frank Comito, says that the recent hotel licensing seminar put on by the Ministry of Tourism was well executed and well received. We shared with them the overall work of the Bahamas Hotel Association, which is always an opportunity to broaden people's awareness of what we do. And, 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 but likewise, we also shared with them some of the challenges as well as solutions that we're working on to uh, ensure the competitive, competitiveness of the destination and the industry, particularly small hotels, and some of the challenges that they're facing with operational costs, with uh, energy costs, with uh, marketing, and, uh, and, and, and ensuring standards are at the level that they need to have them. I mean, we just gave them a realistic picture of some of the challenges that our industry faces. The week-long seminar focused on introducing the new hotel licensing board appointees to all the nuances of the hotel industry. Comito was impressed with the curiosity of the new board members. The new board members were incredibly receptive to what we offered. I think we opened their eyes a bit as well on, on the work that the industry does do. A lot of what we do is is not championed in a big way or, 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 or publicized in a big way, but we do lots of work with uh, with government and partnership as well as uh, with our schools and, and in training and so on. And, uh, and uh, we, we were pleased to have the opportunity to share that with them. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.